How's it going once again guys and welcome back to Dead Rising 3 last time we were together. We it was a bit weird. It was very weird. There was a guy in a mansion over there that was making zombie porn and we helped. Yeah, we 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 helped him. And now I feel a little bit dirty because of that. But anyway, what are we going to do today? I think what we're going to do today is we're going to move straight on with the main objective because we've got chapter 3 which is find the illegally infected person. But before we do that, there are some um, blueprints over there which I think we should probably go get. I'm not sure how to get them, but I'm sure if we have a bit of a look-see around, we will find a way in. Um, do you reckon we can get up there? Go on, up we go. Nope. Damn it. Okay, fair enough. We can't get up there. Right, there must be an easy way into that building. The whole thing seems to be pretty damn thingied, you know. Some thingied? Defended? What's the word I'm trying to find? I can't think of the word I'm trying to find. I don't think it really matters that much, to be honest. Also, I'm feeling a little bit tired today. I don't think I've had my my normal six cups of coffee a day. Oh, clear zombies around Mel. That might be why I'm feeling a little bit tongue-tied. You know what I mean? Okay, so are we just going to kill the zombies that are chilling around the bottom, or has she got more zombies around the top of her? I think it might just be these zombies. Okay, let's try and kill these ones. Aha! And my pole weapon is going to die in a minute. Yeah, it's dead. Okay, you know what? I'm going to stand back, and I'm going to do it in a cool way. Thank Aha! So <laughs> That's one way to clear a load of zombies. Ow! Get off! Friggin' things. Right, I think we should definitely head in the direction of the main objective. There are a couple of blueprints around that I do want to get, but first and foremost, I think the objective is our... Oh, wait! No, maybe not. Maybe not the objective. Possibly not. Player is joining? There was somebody joining my game? Wait, wait, what? I'm not sure how happy I am about that. Every time somebody's joined my game so far in every game on the Xbox One, they've ended up causing chaos. And the, the whole thing has gone horribly, horribly wrong. So I always get a feel, like, you know, I always feel a little bit apprehensive when someone joins the game. It's like, oh God, they're going to approach me. They're going to kill me. It's all going to go horribly wrong. And we're all going to be very angry. But hopefully that doesn't happen this time. There is a Frank statue around here somewhere. Oh, I think I can hear them. I can definitely hear them. <laughs> I don't, I'm not sure whether they can hear me, though. But if they can, it'd be entertaining to know where they... By the way, they've just walked in on a walkthrough for YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Player is born. Okay, I need to find a way to get myself out of this. Um, options. How do I get out of this? Oh my god, there's the person. What's happening? Tattooed Gamer X3. Okay, I'm leaving. Stop this noise, I'm out of here. <laughs> I'm gonna go do the mission. Just because otherwise they're probably not gonna stop shouting at me. Alright, run. Run away from the guy. Just leg it. Leg it and eventually hope that he'll go away. I don't know whether you can hear him. I certainly can. Go, 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 go. Hopefully it's a proximity thing. And if we get the hell away from him, then he'll stop talking. Run. Just run away. I don't think I have my connect plugged in. Well, you know, the chat function is on the connect active at the moment. So I'm pretty sure he can't hear a thing that I'm saying. Which is probably good because he'd think I was, I was mad, you know? I'm trying to listen to what he's saying. He just seems to be shouting gibberish. Okay, I think before we move on, I should probably find out how to get rid of that guy from the game, you know? Map and missions, players. Is he following me? I think he might be following me. Boot player. Yep, boot him. Did I boot him? I think... <laughs> I just booted him from the game. I kind of feel bad about that. But oh well, it's fine. Let's move on with the objective, shall we? And ooh, hello. That's a weapons blueprint. Who the hell are you? What is that? The zombie raker. What? Who's this? How's this woman? Is this a zombie? Oh no, no, she's just covered in tattoos. Okay, fair enough. So she's not a zombie. Now, I want to see what blueprint we just picked up there. What was it? The weapon raker. No, the zombie raker, sorry. So that's a katana sword and a leaf rake. Ooh, I have a katana sword. One right in front of me, actually. I think I might have another one. No, I don't. I don't have another katana sword. But I have a leaf rake. 
So let's combine the two and create ourselves a zombie raker. Yay! Awesome. Zombie raker. Okay, so what's this woman got to say? Listen, I'm looking for a girl called Annie. Is she around? How do you know Annie? I could let you in if you do me a couple favors. Oh, come on. Really? Like what kind of favors? Look, we had to abandon our other safe areas in a hurry. I left some important stuff behind. My tattoo kits over at the school and my wedding ring. I left it at that half-built house. We were being chased. It's in a box. Okay, I'll get your stuff, but then you're gonna let me see her. Yeah, that's the deal. Tattoo oh. kit from the school, ring box from the house. Look for the graffiti. Okay, lady, you got a deal. Okay, so I've got to find a tattoo kit. Which, you know, I'm not going to say is something you really need in a zombie apocalypse. Do you reckon she really needs that? I wouldn't really say it's a definitive want. Yeah, well, I suppose it's a want rather than a need, isn't it? It's like, I need my tattoo kit, otherwise I will not be able to survive this outbreak. It's like, oh, come on, lady, really? Seriously? Tattoo kit? I think she's already got enough tattoos, wouldn't you say? She seemed to be covered in the bloody things. Okay, anyway, find that tattoo kit. If that's what we need to do, then that's what we'll do. Oh, and there's another blueprint here. I'll be taking that if you don't mind. Oh, it's a weapons blueprint. Oh my god. The party slapper. I'm gonna make the party slapper. Oh, is that slappy? That is. Oh my god, that is cool. So, you know, fuck off. So, how do I get in the party slapper? Oh my god. Kill the everything. And maybe kill us because I can't actually get out of this area. Get out of the way. I have the party slapper and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> this is brilliant. We've just mixed a street cleaner with a happy slappy thing. Alright, what kind of weapons do I have? Because there's one of those things down there. Okay, let's get out. And let's take a look at our weapons. Okay, we've got an RPG. One way to take it out. And fire! Excellent. Level 20 has been reached. Okay, let's get back in the party slapper. Dun, 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 dun. I'm in the party slapper. Dun, 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 dun. And I'm stuck. Ah! Oh, blowing up cars and things left, right, and center. But that's okay. That's not bad. Right, what's that? Press for more info. Oh, I've got some unused attribute points. That seems to be what it's shouting at me about. Fair enough. So, should I go with life, inventory? I kind of think I should go with inventory. Having an extra slot would make a lot of sense at this point in time. So, we've got three. We could go for a melee skill. Or ranged, mechanic, practice makes purpose. Whip up combos faster. I don't think we really need that yet. That does seem to be one of those pointless things. So, all that cross-training zombie killing is paying off. Run longer for more often. So, that's the sprint recharge and the sprint duration. Yeah, why not? We'll have that. And the smart. What is the smart? Finders keepers. Of PP, that is. Now you can find every collectible. Ooh! Okay. So, that increases my collectible detecton detection radius. That could be pretty useful, actually. Oh, my God. Okay. So, we're at the school. Now we just need to break our way in. And there's a lot of zombies there, so come on! Let's do this! I have a katana on the end of a leaf rake. And all you have is teeth and claws. I think I'm going to win this argument. Come on! That is a weird amount of PP to get from these kills. 96. Eh, fair enough, I suppose. Wait, can we go up this way? Oh, hello. Oh, I think we found the way in. We have indeed found the way in. Marvelous. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna eat a hamburger first. Nom 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 nom. Marvelous. And swap out for my leaf raker again. Oh, there's definitely zombies in the school. Oh my god! What the No, good boy! Bloody quarterback. There's another one as well. There we go. Kicked his ass. Now, where is our tattoo kit? gonna be in here somewhere so wait what's going on what is that music suddenly a load of dramatic music in the background is that because we're fighting these guys I will kill you from behind 600 pp for killing a guy oh another one haha <laughs> killing those guys is pretty easy 
So I think the safe house is downstairs. Oh, there's another one. There's another quarterback. I get lots of points for killing a quarterback. Is there any more? Oh, there's two more. Hey, guys. How's it going? How's it hanging? Short, shriveled, and a little to the left? Fair enough. Come on. Where's the other one? There was another one in here. There he is. Get back, you savage. And I think we found the tattoo kit. Nope, that's a chair. Let's put that chair down. I'll throw that over there so it's out the way. And pick up that tattoo kit. There we go. We have acquired that tattoo kit. Dun, 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 dun. Now, is there anything in here that we can combo together? Right, we got a couple of 2 by 4s It's not exactly useful, but what about... Wait, this is a safe house, isn't it? So the fact that this is a safe house means that we could possibly clear this thing out. Because we do need to clear the safe houses out eventually. So... Oh, what's that? Oh my god, I found a chainsaw. I'm taking it. Just because I can. Actually, do I already have one? No, I don't. I think I dropped it before, didn't I? So clear the safe zone. I am trying to clear the safe zone. Where are the zombies? Are there any more of them in here somewhere? Wait, there was... Oh, there's one! Oh my god! Good... Oof! Okay, I'm going to swap for the Raker again. That seemed to work. Is he dead? I did... Kill him! There we go. Is that the last one? Safe zone cleared. Hell yeah. Oh, and a big gun. That's an assault rifle. And anything else in here? No, we got some cold medicine. Can I take some cold medicine? I might as well take some cold medicine. Hopefully it'll, it will boost my health a little bit. That's good. And I'm going to swap out for the Raker. So we're done in here, I think. There is maybe... There's a blueprint around here, I think. Where is this blueprint? I can't seem to find it. Um, We could get some survivors out here. That's one thing we could do. But I've got a feeling if we do get survivors out here, they're going to die. Especially that guy. He's not exactly all that, is he? Alright, you know what? I'm going to get Anna out. Hopefully she can give us a hand in this this non-shambolic... Non I can't think of the word I'm trying to think of. I'm having a really bad day for that today, aren't I? I keep just dropping the words that I'm trying to think of. So, I think that's probably, you know, yeah, a thing is exactly what I'm trying to say. I'm going to move on and go on to some words that are a lot less intricate than the ones I'm trying to say. <laughs> Because <laughs> at this point in time, I'm just embarrassing myself. Okay, so let's move on and let's get ourselves a car, shall we? Damn it, why am I having such trouble with English words today? Get out of the way! Feel free to dislike this video all you want, because like, my god, this is just some rambling idiot. I kind of am at this point, aren't I? Alright, where's Anna? Anna, get in the car! Come on! What are you doing? What crew? Why are you stuck behind a bloody car? Get... Get in the car, you were just causing trouble. Get in the goddamn vehicle. Thank you very much. This is why I don't use survivors. They always tend to cause trouble. And it never really helps me out, to be honest. Back off. Don't let them free ride. Don't let them free ride? What are you talking about? This woman's mad. Okay, right, we can't go any further than this. I like how she dived out as well. That was actually quite impressive. <laughs> right, 200 meters. We can probably run that distance. I'm not going to try it with a car again, because every time I get into a car, she has trouble getting into the car. Because she gets stuck on something, or gets eaten by someone, or, you know, it's just it just causes problems. Oh, is there a Frank thing up here? Or down here? Nope. Oh, zombie. Kill the zombie. And then run away. Got a couple of firemen up there. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, I found a blueprint. Awesome, what is that? The fighting gloves. Oh, crap. Oh, my God. Okay, so how do I make the fighting gloves? Because we have just set off the alarm in this shop, which isn't good, because that means all the zombies are going to come running in. Running in. So we got game console and a toy gun. So I've got a toy gun. Oh wait, no, that was grenades. 
not exactly what we wanted to pick up. Grenades are pretty useful anyway. Sod it, use a grenade. Get back, you savages. Okay, pick up the toy gun. There we go, we got the toy gun. And we've also got a tire, which I don't know why we have that. I'm not going to question it, though. Let's make ourselves some fighting gloves. Ah, we make ourselves some fighting gloves, we do. Ah. So let's see how good these are. Come on! Let's do this, zombies. Those are actually pretty cool. So what does the Y attack do? Ow, the Y attack does nothing. The Y attack is actually kind of useless. All right, fair enough. Now let's move on and head towards the main objective. Because we're trying to... What are we trying to find now? I can't remember. I think we're trying to find... What is it? Lauren's ring box. Right. Oh, here's the safe house. This is the place I've been trying to get into, but... Oh, no. What's this? What is this? Oh, my God. There's a load of those mercenary dudes. Oh, hello. Ow. Son of a bitch. I'm going to make myself a roller hog out of their bikes. <laughs> Why not? There we go. There's a roller hog there. Oh, can I make something out of these as well? Is that the... Oh, that's the party slapper. Okay, so we don't want to make the party slap. We've already made the party slap before. Come on, you. Yeah. One hit and you're down. Punk. And you. Let's do this. Come on. Oh, I almost killed Anna. I'm so sorry, Anna. That was a mistake. Hey, buddy. And that's one hit down. Wait, can I combine these two bikes together? Ah, oh, cannot combo. Do not have blueprints. That's a shame. Um, now, how do I get into this building? That is the question on everyone's lips. There might be a way in up here. It did. She did say look for the paint. Because the paint seems to be something that points us in the direction of where we need to go. Oh, we got more guys. Should we kill these ones as well? Yeah, why not? Hey, buddy. Come on. I'll kick your ass. And there we go. Anyone else? Oh, there's another one. I'm gonna kick your ass because I can. Down, 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 down. Ow. Damn it. Come on. There we go. Okay, now back to the uh, task at hand. How do we get into this place? So we've got post no bills. Yes, I, I can I can see that. I'm. Oh, wait. What the hell? This wasn't here before. Maybe it's because we didn't do this mission yet. That's the reason why this hadn't been unlocked. That would probably make sense. So weapons blueprint. What we got? We got a defiler. That sounds awesome. Now how do we make that? Let's have a look. We got... Do, 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 do. A defiler is made using a sledgehammer and a fire axe. So we got a sledgehammer. We'll take that. And I could probably... Maybe swap out these controls, because I don't actually have the car anymore. No, not the remote control. We want to pick up the fire axe. There we go. Marvellous. And combo for the Defiler. Awesome. That's pretty cool. Okay, now, how do I get into this safe house? There's still the... Oh, here we go. Jesus! Oh, it's these guys! These guys seem to have made the safe, the safe house their own. Ow, <laughs> that's not fair. Okay, I'm going to go back to these gloves. Because they seem to take them down pretty nicely. Come on! Yeah! Anyone else? Is that it? Safe zone has been cleared. Da -da 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 -da. And lockers are now available, so... That would mean that that is her ring box. There and we got it. We got the ring box. There it is. Sweet. And we got to return to Lauren and that will... Oh, what's that? The Undead Solutions. Undead Solutions available in Survival Guide. Uh, I'm not sure what that means. Decrease zombie detection radius. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I think I might read that in a bit. But before I do, I'm going to end that one there. So thanks for joining me, guys, in this episode of Dead Rising 3. I know I've been a, bit, a little bit tongue-tied. I've been forgetting my words. I don't know. I think I'm just a little bit tired, to be honest. So I'm going to have a bit of a break now. I might come back later. And I shall see you in the next one anyway. So thank you for joining me. Bye-bye.